And that is not something that has changed. It's more artful now. But he is so skillful, he don't have to kill you now. He has your brother so silly that your brother will kill you. So he stands back. He kills a few. And we take care of the rest. But he has many more skillful ways of killing people today. It's not about popping you. Like assassinating, you know. They make it look reasonable. The mayor fell over on his desk. What's wrong? Well, he, he was a little overweight. He died of a heart attack. It could be. But the enemy is so skillful today, he can make death look natural. It's not an accident that so many leaders across this world of our people have prostate cancer. That's not an accident. There's a way of giving you cancer. In Africa recently, they sent a vaccine over for polio. And they vaccinated about 160,000 children. Come to find out the vaccine was poison. You don't have any pharmaceutical plant to manufacture those pharmaceuticals that will inoculate you and your children against disease. Gaddafi was building one. And one in the United States Senate said, if he continues, we'll drop an atomic bomb on him. They bombed the pharmaceutical plant in the Sudan. Because the black man must never be able to prepare health for himself. He must depend on Europe, the former colonial master, and America. So as they deep populate Africa with AIDS and Ebola and other man-made viruses that destroy the immune system of the human being. Don't tell me that you don't need to know God today. Don't tell me you don't need to know a savior today that can deliver us from the wicked plans of our enemies.